Hello, and welcome back to our Skyrim Let's Play Path of Belthazard Great. Yeah, yesterday we, where we left off, we have <laughs> we had uh, pimped out our Skyrim home here with a mod. <laughs> Whereas I tried to trick you into believing that it was actually in the game. So yeah, um... I just got stuck there. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, and uh, we battled a... Uh, a leader of those bandits uh, with this epic dragon armor on and I'm like okay so should I uh, take this as my battle mage armor and stuff like that it is heavy uh, and I will be somewhat slowed but with my wings I should be able to get out of the wave quickly enough hey Sophia how you doing man you're just like like a zombie just hello you oh there you go <laughs> okay, so what should we- So you can enchant stuff, huh? I bet I could enchant your sword. <laughs> what? I spent some time at the College of Winterhold, but... Come to think of it, that was a disaster, so maybe not. You can enchant something else? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I'm such a perf. Uh, yeah, uh, let's see here, what should we do? Um... Okay, Fo, shut up. Uh, bring the false document to... Uh, okay, yeah, maybe we should do this one. Continue our, our route with the... Uh, how you doing? Is that an amulet of Mara? I'm surprised someone like you isn't spoken for. Yeah, well... Let's so, get going, then. So it's not gonna be you, Lydia. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. I, w I want to see something. I've got your back. Um, it's time for us to part ways. I'll head back home if you need me. Cool. So, is she going, yeah, she's going to, uh, yeah, she's going, probably going to, uh, White Run. Okay, I gotta figure out how, uh, a way to, uh, yeah. When you have multiple homes, the first home is always going to be your locked home, like, for uh, the house carls here, apparently. So, yeah, I gotta, uh, maybe there's a mod out there that can uh, say, uh, nope, you're going to stay here and not there. I'm a little busy at the moment. I've got all sorts of errands. Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, what are you doing, kids? You should see me when you get bored, stranger. What are you doing? Papa says I won't see Ravir anymore. But he wouldn't tell me why not. Hmm. Pardon me. Hey, wanna play tag? <laughs> hey! Lucy! Where are you going, Lucy? The palace looks so pretty. I wish they'd let me inside. Okay. I wish uh, there was a mod where you can, uh, like, uh, time to go home, let's play a game, uh, go do your chores. Yes, Pa. Good girl. Like, I could go in and out of the passage like I, I want to, because I'm the Dover King. <laughs> yeah. But, uh... I was uh, hoping that uh, I could like bring my children with me, be more interactive with the. You heard of Ravens Car Hollow? Cave on the island to the west. Places a roost for those foul hag ravens. Thank you very much. These solitude guards really know their stuff. Oh my goddamn wings! Hey, the Kashits are gone. Okay, why am I running? Uh, yeah. Okay, I need to bring it back to Dawnstar. Let's fast travel to Dawnstar then. Oh, I don't have... Uh, remove it. What? Then we gotta go down here. Oh, a bit... Uh, late on this. Yeah. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. Where do you want to go? Uh, don't stop. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Oh, steady. 
When people you ever think met of one of them else, cats? they usually think of Hajib, trees, but not me. I hear this whole country. <sighs> God damn it. I can actually see where the roots are going to take us all the way down there and up there. Yeah. Okay, let's just. Ah, the Kashits are here. Bandits harass the caravans at every step, but Khajiit usually scare them off. A few days ago we were ambushed. A nuisance, really. But many of the marauders had quick fingers. One of them stole my moon amulet, given to me by my mother when I was just a cub. It is my only memory of home in this cold land. You are kind to offer. We believe the bandits are part of a group headquartered here. Be careful. I missed my amulet. But a life cannot be replaced as easily. May your road lead you to the road one, makes this one weary. I hope that you will come to do business with us again. The roads of Skyrim lead to many dangers. So many refuse to talk to us. They call us thieves and smugglers. I am glad to see that you are not such a one. Mostly, it is the Nords. They do not like outsiders in their land. And so we are forbidden to enter their cities. When they look upon us, they see only pickpockets and skooma dealers. It is most unfair. But we do our best to ignore them. Not long in truth. I came to Skyrim after I found myself unwelcome in both Elsewhere and Cyrodiil. I seem to have an unfortunate talent for getting myself involved in misunderstandings with the law. Rassad was able to look past that, and it was he who helped to set me up with a trade caravan. Now I work for him. Mm. Uh, I was uh, actually. May the sun keep you warm, even in this land of bitter cold. Yeah, I was actually thinking about. Uh, there are, uh, I think, there's three caravans in Skyrim, uh, th or maybe only the two, uh, this one and uh, the other one, but I'm not sure. Okay. Divine sakes, Gold. Who do you think we're threatening with our old war wounds? We're not soldiers anymore. Your man Horik is wearing his old Legion armor. What should I make of that? He's proud of his service, Scald. The Legion taught us loyalty, and we're loyal to Dawnstar. This I've isn't over. I catch you sending die, one letter to General Tullius. They were when I'll they have you died. both executed. If you die naked, are you all right? does your spirit you remain time. naked? I'm fine, Horak. I, I just... can't say a fancy roaming around you either about in Sovngarde or as no. a ghost without if we any must clothes fight, on. We will, and well, you will lead us to victory, as you always have. With you by my side. Is that right, Horak? Of course. I would have it no other way. So much for old soldiers settling down to a life of luxury, eh? You come to Dawnstar at a bad time. Tempers are fiery. Not a single man or woman in Dawnstar has gotten a good night's rest in days. We keep having the same nightmare, over and over. If people aren't tired, they're angry. And if they aren't angry, they're afraid. It's made keeping order a mess. I hear Mara has sent one of her priests to the inn to try to calm people down, but I don't know how much words will do now. Skald supports Ulfric's rebellion, and he doesn't like having a couple of old legionnaires living in his town. He's a fool. A dragon has attacked Helgen. Dawnstar needs the Empire now more than ever. Which is why I'm here. I am with the Stay out of trouble now. <sighs> Why does it want me to go up there? That's weird. Oh, 
Dawnstar Barracks. I'm probably supposed to give him the Pickpocket. I'm out of here. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Uh, I submit. Take me to jail. Smart man. Now, come along with us. We'll take any stolen goods, and you'll be free to go. After you pick. Okay. I'm not supposed. I don't think I'm supposed to pickpocket him. I think I'm supposed to give him. Talos guide you. I have important documents for you, sir. Is that so? I don't recognize you. Why aren't you wearing your Stormcloak colors? It uh, it distracts from this. Easier to sneak past enemies. I suppose it would be. Good thinking. All right, let's take a look. Ah, good. Looks like the reinforcements for the fort are on the way. And we have some information about enemy troop movements as well. Excellent. It's not easy running messages, what with Imperial scouts crawling all over the place. No, well sir. Done. Why don't you grab yourself a drink at the Wind Peak before heading back? Thank you, sir. All right, then. Cool. So I was, I was not supposed to give it to him. Yeah. I derped out a, uh, a minute there. <laughs> I've done that quest a million times and like, yeah, I'm like, still a novice. Mm. Ah, cheese and coffee mix. Okay, cool. I'm gonna go the right way. Up. Hey, yep. Forge down there. Whoa! Well, ain't you a sexy thing? Need a room? Don't worry. Nightmares don't seem to happen for travelers. Heard any rumors? People say there's someone in Riften that can change your face, make you look completely different. Do you believe that? Everyone in town knows about the Black Door. And to never go near it. Mm -hmm. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Oh, wouldn't it be this good if we could make mm -hmm. money, but without helping other people? <laughs> what troubles you, my son? The entire town is being plagued by horrible nightmares. They're in serious danger, and I'm afraid there's little I can do about it. Hmm. What, uh, what could you do any, anyway? Dreams aren't real. These dreams are manifestations created by the Daedric Lord, Vermina. She has an awful hunger for our memories. In return, she leaves behind nightmares, not unlike a cough marks a serious illness. I must end her terrible influence over these people before the damage becomes permanent. What's your plan? I need to return to the source of the problem, to Nightcaller Temple. Perhaps you'd be willing to assist me in that regard. Actually, I wouldn't mind. I've already said too much. If anyone overhears what we're saying, it could start a panic. I would simply ask that you trust me and help me end Dawnstar's nightmares. <clears throat> Wonderful. My Lady Mara will be quite pleased. Nightcaller Temple is only a short walk from Dawnstar. Come, we must hurry. I promise to answer all of your questions. Follow me. Hi there. Thoring runs the inn. Speak to him. 
This one's a favorite of mine. A legend yes. we all know and love. They're dead. My pa was a sailor. Took me with him on his last trip. After he got sick, they put us off here and left without us. He died a few days later. I've tried to make do since then, but it's been hard. Real hard. We just found ourselves another kid. Really? Do you... Do you have a place I can live? Oh, wow! Are you... Are you sure? You really wouldn't mind? Really? You mean it? Wow, thanks, Pa! I promise I won't be any trouble at all. We just got ourselves another kid. Just... Just let me get my things and say goodbye to everyone. I'll meet you at home. Thanks. Thanks again. <laughs> Okay then, let's uh, save uh, Dawnstar from this terrible nightmare business. Oh. oh yeah, and by the way, if you see me going down in the uh, video... Follow me, it's this way. Sorry, I just gotta deal with something first. I beg you, don't go into Silas's museum. Silas comes from one of the oldest families in Dawnstar. They have a complicated history. Several of his ancestors belong to the Mythic Dawn, the cult that almost destroyed Tamriel. His family's involvement was only found out well after the crisis had died down, but it still ruined their reputation. Mm. They were outcasts. And now Silas is back. And this museum to the mythic dawn is his way of trying to rebuild his family's pride. It's misguided. That museum is a mistake. It seems like these guys here. Die, Dawn God. That doesn't sound very pleasant to me. I mean, who in the right mind would eat? Giant stow or troll fat? As for eating thistles and antlers? That sounds painful. Good job. Okay, wait a minute. Where are these vampires coming from? We need to wipe them out before things get worse. <laughs> Sorry, but sadly you can't go. <sighs> What are you all doing around Wolfie? Kajit is ready for any troublemakers. Hmm. <sighs> okay. Uh ah, there we go. I think we went the wrong way. Yeah. Most people usually buy me first. Sophia. Come on, Wolfie. Mistake!
idea. That's a dragon's call. Since it's me, though, they may be a little more forgiving. Did you guys hear that? That was a dragon's call. That's dragon's breath. Okay, that tail is twitchy. It's a twitchy tail. Twitchy, 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 twitchy. Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Where is he taking us? Oh, I know where he's taking us. He's taking us up there. This way, my son. Well, that was an unpleasant bit of business. Crosses me! You racy boy. an unpleasant bit of business. I'm pretty sure this is the place he's taking us. Yep, it is. Uh, yeah. You know what, guys? I'm thinking that uh, this weekend, instead of something uh, random, we're going to do two more episodes, Saturday and Sunday, with Skyrim. Plus, on Sunday, it's going to be an extra video with uh, the second part of my Terraria multiplayer Let's Play. Before we enter, I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. Years ago, this temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. They were being plagued by nightmares, just like the people of Dawnstar. No. Knowing they could never defeat the orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma, putting everyone to sleep. I'm concerned that when this place is unsealed, the Miasma will dissipate and they'll awaken, both orcs and priests alike. The Miasma was created by the priests of Vermina for their rituals. It's a gas that places the affected in a deep sleep. Because the rituals would last for months or even years, the miasma was designed to slow down the aging process. Oh, nice. Sadly, yes. The longer an individual is exposed to the miasma, the more the mind can become damaged. Mm. Those who've been under the effect of it for extended periods of time have been known to lose their minds entirely. In some cases, Whoa. a few never awoke at all. Vermina resides in a strange realm known as Quagmire. Who else but Quagmire? He's Quagmire, Quagmire. You never really know what he's going to do next. He's Quagmire, Quagmire. I like where this is going. Giggity, giggity, giggity. <laughs> 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 the reality shifts upon itself in seemingly impossible ways. From her citadel at the center, she reaches forth to collect our memories, leaving nothing in return apart from visions of horror and despair. <laughs> Who can say? Perhaps she collects them for display like works of art in a nonsensical art gallery. Whatever the case may be, her intentions are far from benevolent. 
Once we get inside, all become clear. Okay. <laughs> Quagmire. <laughs> For fuck's sake. And there goes the game. But you know what? Actually, this might be a good time to say thank you all so very much for watching. I catch on the flip side. Who else but Quagmire? He's Quagmire, Quagmire. You never really know what he's gonna do next. He's Quagmire, Quagmire. I like where this is going. Giggity, giggity, giggity.